Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm Holly Honjo. I've had a lot of new subscribers lately. Thank you so much. If you haven't already, please just take a moment to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit the bell so you get notifications every time I post a new video. Thank you. Um, going back to that, so I've got a lot of new subscribers and I thought I'd really like to do a workout video, but really going back to the basics because while I feel like I'm kind of steadily progressing and hopefully you are too if you've been following along with me, there's a ton of new people who've just joined and have never worked out with me before. So why don't we go back to the basics? We're gonna be doing a full body dumbbell routine. I'm definitely gonna be taking things a lot slower than usual, um, explaining the moves a bit more and um, as usual modifying. Originally when I started this video, I was doing it for fat people. Um, but I'm just seeing such an incredible response from people who are not overweight, but people who have limited mobility, maybe have a disability, um, or uh, recovering from surgery. Just so many people who are excited and interested and happy to see somebody, um, <laughs> I don't know if I want to say normal, but I guess I'm normal, but I'm fat. Um, but you know, somebody just who isn't someone who they can keep up with. And that makes me so happy. Anyway, I'm going to stop waffling on now um, and let's get started with our warm up. We are going to begin with, um, so just doing some leg kicks, kick your legs up to your bum and then put your arms like this. I don't know what to call these, I'm sorry. Um, like let's stretch our arms in front. We usually do around 20 of these, but I also usually lose count, so never mind. <laughs> let's just get loosened up a little bit. Do four, three, two, one. We'll do some arm circles and back. Whew. Yep. Ooh. Okay, so you are going to need your dumbbells. If it's your first time working out, I suggest you go for lighter weights. Um, and I'm not going to repeat that the whole time throughout everything. So just, just go with lighter weights until you get a feel for what you can manage. Do not overdo yourself, go at your own pace. If you can't finish a set or, um, you know, just sit it out, wait it out, get your breath back. But we are gonna be going pretty slow, so I'm hoping, you know, most people are gonna enjoy it and be able to keep up. So we're gonna start off with bicep curls. So, grab your weights. You wanna put your legs a comfortable distance apart. Keep a little bit of a bend in your knees back in a neutral position. Bring your arms to your sides. Keep your elbows tucked in at the side. And then we're just gonna bring it up for 10. One, two. As you bring it up, exhale. Inhale as you come down. Seven, eight, Make sure you keep the movement very controlled. And 10. You don't ever want to let those weights just drop because that's going to do yourself an injury in your elbow, okay? So always keep it controlled as you bring it down. Okay, next we're going to be moving on. We're just going to do a little bit of cardio. We're going to march it out for 20. Exhale. 
Exhale. How many have we done? Nine. Ten. Perfect. Now we're just going to repeat that. So back from the top, we're going to be doing our bicep curls, elbows in at the side, roll your shoulders back. Here we go. Let's go for ten of these. Swing those 
arms as well. Let's get those heart rates going.
crunches. Here we go. One.
This is eight, nine, ten. Side jacks, here we go. Is everybody feeling like they've got a good sweat going? Roll those 
your shoulders back. Take a few breaths. Thank you so much for all your support. I will see you all again very, very soon. Bye-bye.